Hi, this is Fahime. Welcome to my presentation on quantitative assessment of bone microstructure in the human knee using photon counting CT. To address the research question, there is a strong need for in vivo microstructural imaging of bone, but to do so, the image modality should provide us with a large field of view, short exposure time, and a high level of details. Micro CT and HRPQ CT as the gold standards for ex vivo and in vivo uh, scanning cannot meet the first two requirements, but photon counting CT or PCCT as a new technique can be a promising alternative. But it's still unknown the accuracy of photon counting CT in micro structural imaging of the bone. So the aim of this study was to evaluate the feasibility of photon counting CT in quantifying bone microstructure as compared to micro CT and HRPQ CT. And here you can see how we developed this study. We took the scans of uh, human cadaveric knees using photon counting CT, HRPQ CT, and micro CT. And then we defined the VOIs in the load bearing regions of femur and tibia. And to get the identical locations for the VOIs on these three different image modalities, we performed the image registration. Here you can see an overlay uh, of photon counting CT and HRPQ CT on top of each other after the registration. Uh, and then we perform the 3D analysis. Uh, let's take a look at the results. As you can see in this scatter plot, bone volume fraction values measured by photon counting in the vertical axis are highly correlated to the bone volume fraction values measured by micro CT and HRVQ CT in the horizontal axis. And also in this table, you can see the correlation for the other parameters also are high for the measurement between the photon counting and HRVQ CT and also for the photon counting CT and micro CT as compared to each other. Uh, so as a discussion, we can say that our findings suggest that the bone microstructure can be quantified using photon counting CT, but the resolution of PCCT can be, might be a limiting factor in microstructural imaging. Uh, 